Hey everybody, Pox700 here, and today we're going to be making a video on how to remove a strip screw on your RC or really for any application you could find. Alright, so first we're going to go over the things that you will need. You're going to need a flathead screwdriver with a, a reasonable sized tip on there. I know. Uh, and then uh, also make sure that your screw is stripped, so before you determine that it's stripped, make sure you try to get it out, obviously, but yeah, and then the Biggest thing you'll need though is a drill with a cutting wheel on the end or a Dremel. Now, uh, the only thing I could find was a Dremel bit, and I don't have a Dremel, and I'm sure many of you don't. So, if you have a power drill though, that'll work too. And so, it has a little circular part here, and you can just fasten it into the drill. And then the I have a little I don't know exactly what it's made out of. Um, it's some sort of uh, plastic compound, I think, but cuts through metal and. Uh, the last thing you will need is For a strip example, screw. Today will be this Axial Exoterra buggy. On the, under, on the underside of the chassis, I have the screw here that is stripped. And uh, it kind of uh, works, but when I really try to turn it, the wrench just turns in there. So now I'm going to show you uh, the process that you will need to do to get, out, to get the screw out of the car. And uh, after this, if you don't have another screw laying around, I figured out that you can actually use this afterwards if you want to, which I will be doing. All right. So what we're going to be doing is taking our Dremel and then um, put on a pretty high setting and you're going to want to just kind of cut into the top of the screw until you have a little slit there. And once you have the slit, you should be able to take it out with your flathead screwdriver. But um, I can't really demonstrate this to you on camera. So you have to set it up to a pretty decent RPM and then just uh, cut a hole. And let, let the drill do the work. Make sure you're not pressing too hot otherwise these little wheels will explode. Um, also, make sure you have some eye protection on while you're doing this. Uh, so yeah, I will show you what the screw looks like when the uh, slit is. As you can see, the slit in the screw has been made uh, with the Dremel. It took about 10 seconds, and uh, now all you have to do is take your uh, flathead screwdriver. Uh, make just just try to find one that's the correct uh, size. Make sure it gets uh, across the actual the original screw hole. And then once you have that, you can uh, you know retighten it if you want to, or you can remove it and put it in a new screw. So that's pretty much it for this tutorial. Um, if you enjoyed, uh, make sure to leave a like on the video or comment if you have any uh, constructive criticism. Uh, other than that, I mean, uh, thanks for watching and uh, have a nice day.